Hey, if you want to get the latest nerd news, specifically Comic Con 2020 and beyond updates, learn more about DC Future State, and hear the latest Funko news, stick around. Welcome to another Discovery Bay Comics production. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. How you doing, everybody? I'm, let's see if it actually works. I'm JV. Welcome to the show. I've got a fantastic show lined up for you. Let me tell you what is going on today. We're going to kick the show off with some nerd news, and this one is Man, it is jam-packed. This is the biggest nerd news segment I have ever had. We're talking Baltimore Comic Con. We're talking LA Comic Con. We're talking MegaCon in Orlando. And then, if you didn't already know, DC done blown the roof off the place. We're going to go through that entire line of comic books coming in January. And then, of course, man, you can't have nerd news without talking the latest releases and Funkos from the Funko News segment. Then, after that, we're getting into the top picks. You know what I'm talking about. I'm going to go back the last 24 to 48 hours in comic book YouTubers, Funko Pop YouTubers. I'm going to give you my top picks from a sea of content. Check them out. There'll be links to these channels on my homepage right now. And then after that, you know what's next. It's the it's the grand pack of the day. It's the easiest way to get the show. If you tag me is specifically on a comic book Funko Pop combination, there is a high probability, my friend, you were going to get that shared. Now, after that, it's the live stream lineup. This is where I'm going to tell you what's happening tonight live in the comic book YouTube world, in the Funko Pop YouTube world, statues, action figures, action figures. Ooh, stick around for top picks. Hint, hint. All right. After that, we're getting to the next segment of what's in the box already. And today's box is brought to us by a great member of the community, Weapon X. Let's see what I got from him in that segment. And then it is Friday. So we're going to be talking. Oops, wrong one. We're going to be talking giveaway. There's no pop review. I'm going to keep going down the line. We're going to be talking Friday's giveaway. What are we giving away? Not one, not two, but three things. Stick around for that. It's super easy. Mostly just got a comment, but you do have to be present to claim your prize. And we'll end up wrapping up the show, of course, talking about that Comic Pop family hashtag that I'm going to ask you to go visit somebody in the live stream uh, in the Top Picks playlist. But first, I want to shout out a couple people. Specifically, my coffee mug today, the original. There it is. There it is. There's some original art. And it's the awkward sip of coffee, Pokan Joe. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. There are links to these channels in the description below. Pokan Joe's comic book review sitting at 516 subscribers. Go check him out. Also, today's t shirt is by me i didn't put it in there but there's a link right over here you can catch this t-shirt or the comic pop family t-shirt in the link below with a discount on the shipping also when we get to it you ready for it today's unboxing is from weapon x and man i've been waiting all day for this one you ready the push to 1000 remember you got to get to the to the next milestone is from my man you ready for it carolina chris two Six. That's right, Carolina Chris26. There's a link to his channel in the description below, and he's only six subscribers away from 800. Let's go check him out. I'm going to shout out the chat after Nerd News Chuck and Shauna take it away. <laughs> So we've got a ton of awesome nerd news stories to get into this week. So let's go ahead and not waste any more time. This is this week's nerd news. Check it out. Okay, so right, before guys. we get into all the nerd news of the week, and man, I'm really excited about talking about these uh, topics. Uh, just a quick reminder, Baltimore Comic Con, we are two weeks away from what is sure to be the fan event of the the century yeah of the season i mean there's uh, currently at the time of this filming you got new york comic-con going on the metaverse going on but baltimore comic-con is really the comic book convention for the comic book fans and it's happening live 
totally for free at BaltimoreComicConLive.com, October 22nd, 23rd to the 25th. That's right. This week, they uh, rolled out their uh, first wave of panels. They're freaking amazing. No I have kidding. it on the highest authority because I... Uh, you know, in mainframe Comic Con, we are producing the show. That's right. <laughs> but a uh, lot more awesome, awesome panels on the way, guys. There's meet and greets going on. They just announced they rolled out all their publishers and their uh, retailers and their exhibitors. There's tons of stuff going on at the Baltimore Comic Con Live.com website. So check it out. There's more going on in there that I could possibly get into in a single segment. So I implore you, check it out. Baltimore Comic Con Live.com. Check it. Sign up for the newsletter. Do whatever you got to do. Get the information. It happens October 23rd through the 25th, and it's going to be freaking insane. Massive. So get excited, guys. Check it out online. We hope to see you there in just a couple weeks. So we've got a ton of awesome nerd news stories to get into this week. So let's go ahead and not waste any more time. Thank you, Chuck and Shauna. Where is my screen window capture? Come on, where'd he go? All right. No, that's not what I want. I lost it. Hmm, that's weird. Try it again. See what happens when you have technical difficulties. Google Chrome, there it is. All right. Thank you, Chuck and Shana, for talking about Baltimore Comic Con, which, by the way, is coming up this month. And man, I went and checked out this website, BaltimoreComicConLive.com. And man, the lineup of people that are going to be in here for the virtual experience. Plus, they've got Q&A panels, meet and greets. And if you don't, if you're not familiar, Baltimore is famous for the Ringo Awards, and they're not giving up on it. The Ringo Awards will be uh, uh, given out live on October 24th, Saturday, October 24th. Plus, there's more stuff in here. They, they're they not playing. They got con exclusives. There's retailers, comics. There's going to be an artist alley. If you want to be in on this Baltimore Comic Con, very simple, BaltimoreComicCon.live. Check it out because it's going to happen and it's going to be great. Now, there's more news over at Comic Con LA's Instagram page. They put this out yesterday or two days ago. It said, we're writing to let everybody know that they're postponing LA Comic Con from December 11th through 13th, 2020. And it has been rescheduled. You ready for this one? September 24th through 26th, 2021. That's right. L.A. Comic Comic Con has been canceled for 2020 and rescheduled for September 24th through 26, 2021. But, you know, there's another big con, and I think the first one to get canceled because it really bummed me out, was MegaCon. Well, MegaCon Orlando's Instagram page released this yesterday, and it says, Co uh, it's their COVID-19 update. Hey, fans. We're looking forward to MegaCon Orlando taking place from March 18th through 21st. That's early 2021, right? So they booked it March 18th through 21st, 2021. And our team is working hard to produce an amazing event. We'll keep you updated. But as you know, every good team has a plan B because there's no way in hell March is going to happen. Your friendly neighborhood fan expo headquarters squad has secured back updates, which these are probably going to be the dates, folks. August 12th through 15th, 2021. So now you got one in the eighth month and one in the ninth month with MegaCon Orlando in Los Angeles probably slotting in right behind it. But, man, that's, that's, that's interesting information. Of course, as you see, they're blowing up. What happens if I buy my tickets? Go check out these two Instagram pages, folks. Also, what happened in the comic book world today? Boom. DCComics.com done blew up everything. Wait till you see how this is going to take over the while. This is going to be the topic of conversation for quite a while. And if you want the scoop from the skinny, go to DCComics.com and get it right here. They're telling you that come January of this year, they ain't playing. January of this year, boom, it is all going to change. You want to see a taste of what is coming in January? Man, the images that they are dropping. Look at some of the titles. The next Batman. There's issues one and two's covers. Dark Detective. Issues one and two's cover. This one also featuring Red Hood. Batman Superman. Catwoman is in the future state. 
Harley Quinn is in there. Nightwing, and this one's interesting. Ready for the next one? Robin Eternal. There's Superman of Metropolis, and then Superman Worlds of War. Look at the getup he's got on. Okay, check out the different Wonder Woman. So now we've got Wonder Woman Immortal, Cor uh, Kara Zor-El Superwoman, Legion of Superheroes, Superman Wonder Woman, but notice she looks different because God, there's coming up in a couple. Uh, Superman versus Imperi Imperius Lex, and then boom, the new Wonder Woman. There she is. Yeah, you heard it, right? They're dropping a new Wonder Woman. They expect to chase on that. Justice League number one with the new Wonder Woman. Of course, the Green Lantern's getting love with the new series. Suicide Squad is not dead. It's coming back. Did that other one that I debated make it through the cut? I don't think I saw them. Aquaman. <laughs> that was a little dig, by the way. <laughs> the Flash. This is great, man. Teen Titans. Shazam makes the cut. And number 26, the final image is the Swamp Thing. DC's about to change it all. DC Future State, folks. Check it out at dccomics.com. All right, now let's get to the next segment of the show, which is actually, let me get over here. Um, it's still nerd news, but it's Funko Pop news. So I got this email this morning. And here's my email. And they're telling me Funko Ween 2, today's Funko Pop exclusives. Now, these are exclusives, and they're telling you what they got. In the sodas, there's Boo Berry, and then there's a pop animation Casper who glows in the dark, right? Then we've got the Homer Jack in a Box and the, uh, the Bride Kevin from the Minions. So here's the Bride Kevin from the Minions. That's great. Homer Jack in a Box. These all were made available today at 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So there still might be a few available. Go check it out. That's... That was sent to me by Funko.com. That, folks, is today's Nerd News. If you're watching this on the Rewind and you want to skip ahead to today's top picks, go right ahead. I'm going to take a moment right now to shout out the live chat here on YouTube. I appreciate each and every one of you who are hanging out with me live right now. MLV Doe, take off, man. How you doing? You are growing so fast. I'm so proud of this guy, the newest Patriot creator to your supporter. There's a link to his channel on my homepage. Yo, Carter, how you doing, my friend? He's doing the comic book thing. Adrian APM is here as well as Glenn Smith and Unruly Simeon. Yes, RSR Collectibles. Thanks for taking the time. Yes, Lou Comics and Pops, one of the old school Gs. I appreciate you taking the time to hang out with us. Jeff Schultz from Chicago. You know he's from Chicago. And Unuseful Unboxing is here. Johnny Five Alive. How are you, Sith Lordy? What is up, my friend? Let's get on to today's show. If I didn't catch you this time, I'll catch you at the next break. Let's get to today's top picks. Oh, wait a minute. I know what's going to happen. I need to turn that part off. Let's get to today's top picks. <laughs> Not ready. I wasn't even on the right page. Poopers. All right, let's get to my home page here. Let's change the header to top picks and you can see the instagram tag of the day is up next and what this segment of the show is folks is the channel was built on the shout out of the smaller youtube content creator i have got two playlists that i maintain pretty much religiously one of them is the live stream playlist we're going to get to that after the instagram tag of the day and the other is the top picks playlist this is filled with videos from the last 24 to 48 hours. Let's go check out my homepage. And if you haven't seen it already, I dropped a two minute, 26 second video, which is gonna be in today's top picks. And also want to shout out the 12 members of the creator tier. If you are not subscribed to these 12 channels, there are links to their channels in my homepage. Please do take a moment and check them out. All right, let's go past the live and down to the top picks and look at what's in the top picks. That's me. That's right. I dropped a pre-edited video. I was actually working on something for next week's show and figured why not release it early? So I did. If you haven't checked it out already, go ahead and check it out. I don't really speak in it. It's just set to music and I got a lot of great feedback and next week's will be even better. I promise you. All right. Next up in the top picks, Brian and Jack, man. They are crushing it. Yesterday, they had the three up and three down, and today they got the bolo list. Be on the lookout. If you're not watching this one, you are missing out.
That's right. The bolo list is broken up into several sections. You got the first appearances. You've got the variant covers. And the, the best one is that long-term play. That's right. Go check it out. It's in today's top picks. Next up in today's top picks, if you're not familiar with another original OG comic book and Funko Pop collector, this is him right here. The spectacular spider grandpa has one of the most amazing collections of Funko Pops you will ever see. Go check out his channel through the link in the top picks playlist. All right, next up, John's Comics with Kids is doing something cool. I love this channel. He's talking about what is worthy of being on the pull list because there's, there's, there's books that you buy and there's books you put on the pull. And there is a difference, my friend. And John's going to explain that in this video. Great job, John, from John's Comics with Kids. All right, next up. I love father-daughter combinations. Actually, all the couples. But this father-daughter duo is killing it. The Poppin duo is absolutely fantastic. Check them out. Six-time Bands for Arms Funko Mystery Box unboxing in today's top picks. And right after them is a father-son combination. Go check out Pop and Sons in today's top picks. Massive. Funko Pop Hall. Did he win? Ah, no spoilers here. All right, next up. This might be one of my favorite gem statues ever. Dude, this Thanos Lady Death statue gem. Awesome. As a matter of fact, that one is worthy of... Let me break it down for you. Where's it at? Lisa Noble is just doing her thing. Man, you are so awesome. Thank you so much for Lisa dropping that wrench action. She is dropping all kinds of great links to great channels. Chili's pull list. He'll be coming up in the uh, in the Instagram tag of the day coming up next, folks. All right, let's get back to the finish up today's top picks because coming up next in my top picks is another on fire channel. But the boys over at Two Brothers are going to be huge. Go check out Nick and Dustin over at Two Brothers Comics. They did a great video titled, Is CoverPrice.com the Best Comic Book Price Guide? I don't know. Check out the video. Now, next up. I don't get enough videos from this guy. So what I'm going to do, and you know where I'm going with this, because I, I kind of teased it at the beginning. Action figures. Ready for this one? If you like action figures, and you know you do. Go check out my man, Count Von Strange the Fourth. He's today's comic pop family hashtag drop. You visit this video, you drop a comment, comic pop family in there, and that's going to gain you an additional entry into to next week's next Friday's giveaway. Just like everybody that did it on last week, Fridays will be entered into this Friday's one of these prizes, right? Go check it out, Count Von Strange the Fourth, and he had me. Well, first of all, I watch all this stuff, but Star Wars? Come on, man. Black Series Beskar Armor Mandalorian? Yes! Go check out Count Von Strange. And finally, to wrap up my top picks, go check out Pop Culture Philosophers and Rockin' Robbie. He's dropping his top 10 comic books of this week, and he breaks down what he read. And at, you know I'm a big fan of Rockin' Robbie. There you go, folks. All right, let's get to today's live stream playlist. Wait a minute. I forgot to take down the graphic. Sorry, man. Oh, sorry about that, Rob. <laughs> Rocky Robbie over here, top 10 comic books of 1014. He doesn't need my help. He's a huge channel. All right, folks, let's get to the next segment of the show, which is the Instagram tag of the day. After I hit the chat real quick, say hi to a couple of other people who popped in. Kenneth Bird, how are you, my friend? Tori from Unuseful Unboxing is here. Yes, he Lou's still hanging out. Adrian APM's dropping some links himself. Thank you very much, Adrian. Thanks to everybody who's hanging out on a Friday because it's what day, what day is it? Do I have it cute? I don't even have that cut anymore. Do I have that cut? Because it's Friday. You ain't got no job. And you ain't got to do. It's no, I don't. I don't. <laughs> All right, folks. Let's get to the next segment of the day, which is the Instagram tag of the day. <laughs> All right. Now I'm going to change the header. I'm changing the header this time. Bam! Instagram tag of the day. Bam! 
live stream playlist. Pam, 26. <laughs> Carolina Chris, 26. All right, let's get to the Instagram tag of the day. And I'm going to go, we'll change this one over here. Be done with the LA Comic Con. I actually had to do a little maintenance, man. I don't, I don't need people tagging me to make their point if you got some beef with somebody. So, yes, I did go through my stuff today, and I had to clean out some stuff. So, first of all, shout out to the 2,648 followers of the channel, which is unbelievable. I appreciate each and every one of you. Let's get on over to the tag and see what we got going on. Yeah, we're looking better now. And we're starting with one that is shareable. I got it. That's a Funko. Is that a Funko or is it a statue? Either way, man, that looks close enough. Hyper Combo Combo Combo. One more time. Hyper Combo Comics says first appearance Friday is coming with Avengers 7, which is the debut of the Illuminati group. Very nice. Shout out to TiVo. Man, good stuff. All right, what else we got in today's Instagram? Key Historian says, this is a very close, this is cool, man. So Key Historian, which I know you got a couple shares coming up later. These are the books he's looking for, folks. Bam, that is very clever. All right, who dad comics and movie? He says, first appearance Friday, he's going with first century. Very nice, from San Diego Comic-Con exclusive even. And my man, tier 23. You knew he was coming 9.8 white pages, of course. First appearance of Carnage, Cletus Cassidy. All right, Mama J, look at Mama J is giving love to MLV too, man. Giveaway, giveaway, day three, 10, 16, MLV comics. Let's try and get, help him get to 100 subs. I agree with you 100%. All right, so the one is uh, to be entered in the giveaway. Follow the rules below. Seven days, seven shout outs. Subscribe. Comment Mama J says hi during our Tuesday live October 20th. One winner will be announced. Prize is anything goes $50 mystery box. Link of current shout out in my bio. This is sweet. I'm digging this, Mama J. Get down on that, everybody. Check that out. All right, next up, J Hood Creative. I'll be there tomorrow morning. I promise. I promise, man. I missed last Saturday. I slept in. Woo! One Saturday, two shows. So first at 10 a.m., he's going to be showing off an AOK from Roger, a.k.a. Metarog, before giving a walk book riddle contest update and another clue. And then at 10.30, we're taking a break from the norm and walking through some eBay shopping tips for the beginners. Very cool. So there's one thumbnail and... Oh. <laughs> Oh, that is awesome. <laughs> it's Coach Vic. Vic, you're after the show. Let's go shopping. I'm just dying to look at some new comics. That is awesome, man. Good job. <laughs> All right, Southern Comic Geeks getting to share today, man. He says, first appearance Friday. We have the first appearance of Darth Revan. Ooh, very nice. Very nice. All right, what else we got? LBD is in. There's a comic book in there somewhere. No, maybe LBD's reposting. Okay, this is um Foxy. Foxy's doing a waffle. There we go. 29 spots left in the AOK -okay waffle from Foxy. You knew it was 1738. All right, here we go. Key Historian is going to get the share today on this one. Hashtag ca Catwoman with the comic pop. You missed the pick. It's comic pop pick of the day. Pick of the day, right? Comic pop pick of the day. It's all right. I'll add it when I share it. Thanks for participating, Key Historian. All right, Mr. Comics 89 says the knockout is back. This time we have Captain America versus Wolverine, a man who can heal from anything against the man who can fight all day. Well, please join us today at 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time to see. Well, actually, you get to vote in the straw pool. You can go ahead and vote for me. It'd be nice. <laughs> I'm going to be battling the side of Wolverine against the biggest Wolverine fan, I know. Big Will. It should be good. All right. Mr. Comics 89, also, he, you know, he's got to have a crown. For the comic pop pick of the day, he's coming with the amazing Spider Man issue number 41 for first appearance Friday, the first appearance of Rhino. Man, that is a nice. I'm going to share that one. That looks great. All right. Chili's pull list, and this is how we're going to close it out, folks. TGIF, the Chili's Pool List family. Today, God is first. The comic of the day is ASM 50 in honor of my man, 
Free Key Lowy. I don't know who that is. Happy birthday week to you, my brother. Moreover, it's Free Key Friday. Be sure to give him a follow here on IG and check him out on his YouTube channel to, for entertaining and insightful comic book related content. I don't even know that. I'm going to have to peep this guy out, man. All right. Enough said. All right. Let's get to the prayer. Ready? Uh, we're going to skip the coffee part. Once the prayer of the day comes directly from the devotional. Father. Sorry. Father. Help me to believe and acknowledge Jesus as Lord, and then help me confidently center my life around that truth. In Jesus' name, amen, Chili's Pullis. Thank you very much, my friend, for participating in today's Instagram Tag of the Day. And everyone else who tagged me in a photo, anyone who got me with a comic book Funko Pop will get shared to the 2,648 followers, and hopefully some of them start to follow you. All right, folks, let's get to today's live stream playlist. Change the header. Yeah. All right, folks. Welcome to today's live stream play. Listen, if you're just now watching me for the first time, which there's no way that's possible, but if you just popped in and you have not already, hit the thumbs up for this video. If you're not subscribed to the channel, think about subscribing and hitting the bell. I think I got a pretty fun channel. I like to shout out a bunch of channels. As you saw in the top picks and as you're going to see in the live stream, I'm about to shout out a whole mess of channels and today could be the day that you find your new favorite channel. All right, first up in today's live stream playlist, I got Spectre Commander just finished. So we're going to go to the next one, which is the Varangian Vigilante, which I can't do because it's already 1 o'clock. So I can't show that one either because I'm not lurking. But the Varangian Vigilante is live right now talking John Carpenter with Stay Puff 1983. Go check that out when I'm done. I'll be done here in about 30 minutes. Next up at 115, Tori over at Unuseful Boxing is going Soda Roulette. Part 3, hashtag Funko. Let me give you a thumbs up, my man. Set your reminder for that one, too. Coming back. All right, next up, I love these two channels. One of them right here, Mr. Techbot, supporter of the channel on Patreon. His channel's right here. He's sitting at 620 subscribers. If you'd like to go check him out. There's a link here, and there's a link in the live stream playlist because he's going live today at 3 p.m. Pacific, 6 p.m. Eastern, and him and Wayco do a collaboration where you get them both at the same time. So if you doesn't matter which channel to go to, drop a like on both. There are links in the in my live stream playlist. Shout out to them. And did I just get it? Whoa! Disco, disco! It is Disco Friday. Now it is. Yes, you Luke Comics and Pops with the Super Chat. I do appreciate you, my friend. Man, I hope you have a great weekend. All right, we're going to hit the chat at the end of this segment, folks. Let's get back to the live stream playlist. Woo! All right. <laughs> Let's get back to it. All right, next up. 3 p.m. I mentioned it earlier. Please, please, please get on over here. <laughs> Hit the thumbs up, set the reminder, and get ready for me to battle Big Will with his favorite character. <laughs> there's a there's a link to the poll in the description right here. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right, next up. Sith Talkers, man, these guys are great, by the way. I had a great time watching these fool, not fool, these fellas, these fellas talk about Star Wars crazy knowledge, crazy mad knowledge, and this is the episode 80. They're talking Mandalorian. Oh, man, Star Wars fans get me all fired up. All right, next up, at 4 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Eastern, Billy over at Economics and Comics. Do I have a bumper in here for you, Billy? Man, come on, they still got it. I still got the sickness one in here. There it is. Ready for the sickness? Are you ready for the sickness? I'm ready. Ready for the sickness? Let's do it. <laughs> All right. Brian Polito's newest Hell Witch Sacrilegious number one Kickstarter. Man, he's buds with Brian Polito, man. That's kind of cool. Go check out Billy live. 4 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Eastern. <laughs> Next up, we got the Gray Man. 31 Nights of Halloween. This is night 17. The Beast Revenge is premiering. This is a premiere video. Pop in on that chat. Be part of that conversation. 
All right, at 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern, three men in a basement, comics and collectibles, officially the longest comic book YouTuber name is going live with Friday Night Lights live unboxing and comic chat. And when they're unboxing, there's a high probability that we may get a... Yeah, <laughs> I love that cut. Oh my goodness. Three minute of basement comics and collectibles, 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern. Woo! Next up, the comic collector. We got Tim the comic collector bringing the Phantom Zone. Superman for all seasons review and Man of Steel movie review. He's got Super Russ. He's got Tim the collector. They're talking Superman. They love Superman. Get up in that conversation. Going live. All right, let's go to the long view. I think there might be a couple more. A couple more. Yes! Two boys in there. Now, this is the one. Go ahead and say this five times in a row. I dare you. Scream Stream number 21 over at Two Boys in There Pops starting live tonight at 6 p.m. Pacific. Don't worry if you don't get there early because it goes all night. <laughs> It does it. It seems it's a long stream. So if you're not in the beginning, don't worry. It'll be going for a while. All right. Also, at, no, no, not also. First at 7 p.m. Pacific, metaphorical Monday, Wednesday, Friday, comic book auction. You know it. He's there. Check him out. I bet you it gets a big crowd tonight. Big crowd, 7 p.m. Pacific. Also at 7 p.m. Pacific, Rockin' Robbie's going Horror Fest 2020 Phantasm Series. I was never a fan of the Phantasm series. That guy really freaked me out, man. I don't know about you guys. <laughs> All right, next up, CBSI Hot Top 10 Live. Oh, my goodness. Hit the reminder. Get the thumbs up. These guys are 20 subscribers away from 2,000. Let's see if they can get it in this live show tonight. All right, what's up next? And finally, to round out today's live stream playlist, holy moly, the Hunt Tag Team Titles. If you don't know what the Hunt is, you missing out. Tony Sanders has a great, it's comic books, but set to the like wrestling trash talking theme. And not only is your book got to be fire, but you better be ready to talk some smack about the other guy's book and be ready to defend yours to the end. It's always a good time. Go check out my man, Tony Sanders in the hunt. Woo! That is the live stream playlist, folks. Next up is not guest channel spotlight because I don't have a guest channel today. I'm going to hit the chat real quick. Next up, we're going to go what's in the box probably, right? What's in the box already? Tiff Lordy's in the chat. Glenn Smith is here. Chili's pull list says 9.8 karate chop. Yes, it's only on the 9.8s, but it could happen. Kate Titus all the way in Japan is still here. Here, link is in the description to vote. And that's right. Yes, Lou with the $5 super chat. I appreciate you. Dennis Hayes is in the chat as well. All right. Splash page. Thanks for stopping by, my friend. And the immortal Biggie Shack yesterday's push to a thousand is in the chat. All right. Let's get to the next segment of the show, folks. Let's see what's in this box already. What's in the box already, JB? <laughs> I hope everybody watching knows that I have a good time with this. All right. So let's get this stuff out of the way here. I'm probably going to Maybe I won't change camera, but I've got a box. There is a link to his channel. And by the way, this is the only way you're going to find this guy's channel because God forbid you type in just Weapon X, you ain't never going to find this channel. You ain't never finding this channel if you just type in Weapon X. You've got to find it with the link. Weapon X, the comic monkey, right here, 379 subscribers. His link is in the description below. There'll be a little card that pops up when this graphic pops up on the rewind. He sent me a box, and does it say? No, no. I thought I was going to get a Fred G. Lay cut, but I didn't. But now he sent me a box. Let's see what we got here from Weapon X. Oh, that's very interesting. Oh, wait a minute. Is this... Because I don't know what if I bought anything for Weapon X, but I'll tell you what. When it starts with a box that's in a box... 
Mm. <laughs> All right. So in the box, we've got a box. Let's see what's in the next box. No, it's not another box. <laughs> I thought it was another box. All right. A couple things, actually. Here's a slab. Did I buy something? Did I buy something? I must have bought something. There is a slab, and there is a note, and it says, and a sticker. Ooh, very nice. Yes, yes, another. I've got a coffee mug already, so now we can put this one on the sticker wall. Oh, we've got a coffee mug already. JB, thanks for the continued support. Sent some extras for the comic fan to give for free. Okay, so these are, we're going to give these away. This, this was taped to this, so I'm assuming we're giving these away, which is good. You know what? We may give these away today. Let's see what's in that first. <laughs> All right, what do we got in here? Oh, there's a whole bunch of cool stuff in here. The little kit. I'm going to give these to the kids, actually. They're going to love those. But in here, we've got some stuff to give away. Giveaway comics. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So these will be given away. I bet you there's 12 if I count. So there's a Detective Comics. There is an Avengers with a K on there. Heck yeah. Let's get that one out there. It's going to be going away. There's two. Another Avengers 261. Very nice. Three. Superman 376. These were books that were sent in from Weapon X to be given away to the community. That's the fourth one. Here's the fifth one. Batman 443. Very cool. Very cool. Iron Man 203. 203. Very nice. The Amazing Spider Man number four. I feel like there's something funky with this cover. It's like it's got to pull out. No, it just pulls out. Know, it's like that. Okay. And then last comic book is another Avengers 269. Very cool. All right. All right, now let's see what the slabbage is. There is a slab in here. Oh, I remember now. Yes. I remember buying this now. Yes, yes, yes. All right. And uh, this is one of those things where the neighbor and you know, you, I don't know, you guys ever notice when I talk to, uh, I, I say that you guys are my comic book cousins because we have things in common. We can talk about comic books. We can talk about Funko Pops. We can talk about movies that we enjoy because they're probably common theme, right? We could talk about uh, action figures or mostly collectibles. We talk about that stuff all day. But if I walk out into the court and talk about that stuff, I get that crazy. As a matter of fact, you know what I get? I'll tell you exactly what I get because I had this queued up for days and I haven't used it in forever but tell me if you guys get this sometimes where you walk out into the you know to the neighbors and, and you mention hey did you get the latest comic book today and they say you got manure for your brains no no i don't i'm just kind of a geeky nerd that way so um when they get when they start talking to you about something they're excited about and you look at them and say that was a comic book and they go no way you go. Umbrella Academy was a comic book, people. It was a comic book before it was a show. And I can't wait to take this out to the court tonight and show the people that it was a comic book. Thank you, Weapon X, for helping me prove my point. Because there's a lot of content that they're watching that have no idea it was a comic book. No idea at all. Right? I'll tell you what. All right, folks, that was the What's in the Box segment of the show. Let's get to the next segment of the show, which, you know, what? I got to queue up the next segment of the show. So next up, we're going to do our giveaway because we're making great time and I didn't have a guest. So we're going to do our giveaway next. But to do that, I'm going to actually get it ready in advance while I shout out the chat. Jason over at Southern Comic Geek is in the chat. How you doing, my friend? I appreciate you. Uh, Chili's Pool, Jeff Schultz, Yessie Lou. Did you say the big lion cat is here? Wait a minute, that'll give me a couple seconds to get something ready. Welcome to the stream, Big Lion Cat. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Thank you very much, Big Lion Cat, for taking the time to hang out with us today. Appreciate you very much. Phil Ailing is also in the chat. I appreciate you, my friend. Sith Lordy is still hanging out. Let's get to today's giveaway. You must be present to claim. We're going to give away a few things. I think we're going to give away three things. Same as last week. So... First, I'm going to just grab any random comment from any content that I have dropped since last Friday, and that is going to be prize one. Prize two is going to be just the comic pop family hashtag drops on the videos. That'll be prize two. And then prize three is going to be something that we're going to do at the end. It's going to be a pick a number between one and however many people are in the live. And you got a chance of winning there. So those are the three three giveaways that we're going to do today. And let's and I'm getting that lined up now with random comment picker, my friend over at the random comment picker. Can I have that one up? All right, you ready? Let's do the giveaway. Yeah, it worked. Why am I so small? Man, I haven't changed this layout in forever. Oh, it's got the old logo on there and everything. Wow. Yeah. All right. Note to self. Update the giveaway lay over, uh, layout. Good stuff. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to toggle back and forth between the random comment picker and the actual videos because we got the videos on the homepage. And I just kind of grabbed the link. So um, we could work backwards. We can work forward. I guess we'll work Sunday morning, Friday, last Friday. We're going to go with last Friday. So last Friday's show, we had Matt and Mr. Comics 89 on and um, we're going to start with that one. So I'm going to grab that link. We're going to go ahead and throw it in the random comment picker. And how many comments did we have? We had 10 unique comments from that video. And the first person going on the wheel for, for the first set of prizes, for the first prize, just comment based, is, of course, my man K Titus. And you can only win once. <laughs> Kate Titus is on the wheel. All right. There you go. Kate Titus, number one. <laughs> what else happened last week? Uh, you know, while I'm doing that, I should actually... Should we grab that one, too? Mmm, because I'm here. You know what? We're going to grab this one, too. This is the Comic Pop Family hashtag was on my man Aaron Loy. AKA Huggably. And I want to go ahead and stash that piece of information somewhere. We'll go ahead and put that aside. We'll come back to that later. Because I said I was going to do the one, so we'll do the one. Well, you know, this is a live production, folks. This is how it goes sometimes. Just hanging out. I know it may not be a great watch at the end, but it is what it is. And, Loy, we'll come back to you later. I'm just dropped your link there. And we'll come back to... The uh, we'll go back to the next video that I had. So we had Friday's nerd news, and then we had Sunday morning chilling. Did anybody see Sunday morning chilling? My no agenda chat on Sunday morning. Well, let's see if anybody commented on my no agenda chat on Sunday morning. We had bam 13 comments on that Sunday morning chat going on the wheel. Jelly Fingers Comics. JB, I haven't caught a Sunday morning comic sorting before today. Love it. Well, Jelly Fingers, that comment is getting you on the wheel, my friend, for the first prize of the day. And next up, we had Monday's Nerd News. So let's go check out Monday's Nerd News. So I'll grab tag off of that one too pause that so monday's nerd news any comment at all 13 unique comments from monday's nerd news and monday's nerd news is gonna bring back who that comics and movies it says i won't in any comment you say comic pop family hashtag thank you very much yes any comment just like that and while we're here, I'm going to go ahead and grab the link for um, my comic pop family hashtag that day, which was uh, my man Adrian APM. But we'll come back and get that later. We'll come back for you later. And what else did I drop? Man, I had a busy week, didn't I? 
Yeah, we, so we did... Um, do, 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 do. And then we had a pop-up shop. Holy moly. Look at that. Uh, copy link address for the pop-up shop. I had two pop-up shops this week. How do you like that? And we had 11 comments on the pop-up shop. And going on the wheel from the pop-up shop show is... Christina Payne with the comment, great live. Christina Payne, you are going on the wheel. Oh, I don't need all the comment. I just need your name. There. All right. All right. Now, the next thing was Wednesday's Nerd News. So we'll go ahead and hit into Wednesday's Nerd News. Man, I put out a lot of content, didn't I? Wow, I'm pretty proud of myself. Let's go check out Wednesday's Nerd News. Drop that one in there. Yep. I want to make sure. How many comments did we have on Wednesday's Nerd News? 15 comments on Wednesday's Nerd News. My comments were in. <laughs> You're funny. You're funny. Big Lion Cat. Should I highlight you? Should I highlight you right now? Huh? Huh? Should I highlight that? You little... <laughs> Big Lion Cat's on the wheel. Let me go back over here to StreamYard and highlight the highlight the Big Lion Cat. Here's my comment. It's rigged. I never get picked. It's rigged. And then he gets picked. It's rigged. He's probably not here. Hello, True Believers. What's up, Perry? <laughs> All right, man. Let's get back to it, man. Big Lion Cat's on there. Look at Nerd News. Who who did I ask you to tag on Wednesday's Nerd News? Let's go take a look. We'll grab that link for later. MLV! Yeah! I asked you to tag MLV. We'll come back and see if anybody did that one when we get to the next giveaway. Now you got great chances right now, folks. There's three videos you could drop the Comic Pop Family hashtag on. I haven't even gotten to that segment yet. You could still get in on those. After that, check this out, folks. Yes, a pre-edited video. I did, didn't I? It's only two minutes and 30 seconds long, man. Come on, go check it out. Did I get any comments on it? I did 13 comments on my two minute and 30 second top 10 video. And from that, we've got Glenn Smith. Awesome top 10. Really like how you put this together. Man, I appreciate that. Seriously, man. Glenn Smith, you are on the wheel. All right. And then the second, the second pop-up shop in a week. Can you believe it? Two pop-up shops in the same week? Let's see what we got there. We had nine unique comments from yesterday's pop-up shop. And going on the wheel, Johnny Five Alive. There you go. Johnny Five Alive. Bam. There you go. There you have it, folks. I don't think there's any more content. Did I have it? Then we had uh, today's nerd news. No, so we're live right now. That is it. Let's go check this out. I have got... Hmm, I'm on the wrong tab. We'll, we have got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven contestants from that. And guess what? We're going to be giving away to them today. Next to the go. All right, you got, oh. You guys ready? I should go big screen for this. You can see the prize. Dark Knight's Death Metal Legends of the Dark Knight number one first print. Boom. Are we ready? How many times am I going to shuffle that wheel? Anybody know? Four. One, two, three, four. And who is going to be getting the first appearance of the Robin King? Is that what this one is? I don't know, but isn't that 
freaking awesome. We're going to count it down. Easy for you to say, right? Here we go. One, two, three, four. And the first prize going off today is going to... Jelly Fingers Comics, congratulations, but <clears throat> you must be present to claim. I don't know if Jelly Fingers is here, so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to actually, you know what, we're going to drop the timer. We'll drop a timer on Jelly Fingers, and we're going to give Jelly Fingers a minute timer to claim his prize, or we will remove Jelly Fingers and spin it again. Because we are giving away a nice Death Metal Legends of the Dark Knight. Number one, first print. 42 seconds left to claim your prize, Jelly Fingers. Get in here. <laughs> Sorry, ML. <laughs> and then here, just we're going to go three, two, one. Done. I am even going to wait for the done. If he gets in there before the done. No. Sorry, Jelly Fingers. I appreciate the comment, but we are going to go ahead and remove Jelly Fingers. We're going to shuffle it four more times. One, two, three, four. And we're going to spin it again. Looking like Christina Payne, are you here? Christina Payne, are you here? Christina, we're also gonna give you the one minute countdown timer to see if you were here. Oh, Jelly Fingers, you're killing me, bro. You are killing me, bro. Oh, no. You had won, but we already went down the timer. Now we're into Christina Payne. Damn, Jelly. Unbelievable. Christina Payne. Winner, winner, chicken. Dinner! Woo! Congratulations, Christina. You are the winner of this first appearance of Robin King. Now, let's get on to the next giveaway. Woo! We'll go ahead and close that one. We're going to go ahead and clear all these names out. There are only going to be three. You know what? No. You know what? How, who are the three names? We don't know. I'm going to tell you what. There's only three chances at the comic pop family hashtag. I'm going to give each person who comes up on the randomizer a comic pop family t-shirt. So let's get the first video. So I'm giving away four things today. 
The first video that we're going to ask, we're going to random comment picker. The first video was last Friday. And last Friday, I asked you to go check out my man Aaron Loy and drop the Comic Pop Family hashtag on him. Comic Pop Family. How many people were down to do that? Nine of you were. This person's getting a t-shirt free of charge. Just tell me what size Johnny Five Alive, you've already got all the t-shirts, don't you? Holy shit. I think you got them both already. Start picking out ones for your family, Johnny Five Alive. You are a winner. All right. In the next video, I believe it was MLV. Was it MLV in this video? No, this was... Um... I can't remember who this one was. Let's, see. Let's go check out who this was. I can't see who it was. Who was this? Yeah, open it up. Open, the, open that one up. The second video was Adrian APM. Adrian APM was the second video. And let's see how many people commented the Comic Pop family on Adrian APM. 12 of you did. And who is getting a t-shirt? K Titus is getting a t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> congratulations keep up the great work i put a couple of new videos up today very nice kate titus getting a t-shirt and the final winner of the t-shirt is from mlv if you drop the hashtag comic pop family on mlv and how many did 13 of you did and who's getting a t-shirt You can't get another one. We're going to pick another one. Johnny Five Alive always participates in that. I appreciate that. Geeky Mama Bear is getting a t-shirt. Woo! All right, folks. I got one more thing. For the people who are in the live right now, for the people who are in the live, um, how many people we got in the live? 26? I'm going to pick a number, and it's not number four. <laughs> it's not there. I'm going to write it down right now. You ready? <laughs> I got I'm gonna wrote a number down. Ready? Between one and twenty-six. And winner gets Hella Risen 3, third print, first appearance of punchline. Hella Risen. You're the villain three. Third print. First appearance of punchline to somebody in the live chat. How many we got in the live? Is it how many? I, I want to whatever the number is in the live chat. We got 26 in the live. We got 26 in the live. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on. All right, man. All right, everybody. 26 in the live. I haven't said start yet. Wait till I get the start. I have to get the start. All right. I'm going to put a start line down. Pick a number. Pick a number. And if you're not in between, I'm going to put a start and an end. I'm going to put a start and an end. Pick a number between one and... You haven't... We, wait, I haven't even dropped the line yet. None of you people are in. It has to be after my starting line. All right. Starting line's down. Who's winning? Okay, I'm here. Did anybody get it before CFAP? Oh, he, Cyborg Dad Mystery did. There it is, Cyborg Dad Mystery. It was the first to Carolina Chris 2. You knew I was going to kick two six. I haven't written out my hands. Come on, man. <laughs> Cyborg Dad Mystery, congratulations. You are getting that hell risen. Uh, number three, third print, first appearance, first full appearance. Woo. All right. Good stuff, folks. I appreciate everybody who's been hanging out. It's Friday. I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up. Oh, my goodness. I got something special, by the way. 
Don't take off early. Don't don't take off before the end. I changed up the end. I I pulled an excerpt from last night's Not Near Mint. You're going to want to stick around for that, folks. Stick around for that in the end. I want to say thank you, everybody, including today's coffee mug sponsor, Pokan Joe's Comic Book Reviews. You know, that awkward sip of coffee. Awkward sip of coffee time. We haven't done that in a while. Ah, oh, it's the nectar of the gods. Oh, yeah. And I want to shout out, today's unboxing was courtesy of Weapon X. I appreciate you. In today's push to 1K is Carolina Chris 26. <laughs> I got everything out of that. All right. Also, don't forget to drop the Comic Pop family hashtag on Count Von Strange the 4th to get your entry into next week's prize. And I want to thank everybody who participated in today's show. I really do appreciate you. If you have not already, please do hit that thumbs up, subscribe, hit the bell, stick around to the end. There's something special, folks. I'm telling you. Don't forget, we had a good time. Peace. Nice work, everyone. Sharp broadcast. Really good. Everyone on the floor as well. Really a lot of hustle. I liked it. So Discovery Bay Comics, for those people out there that don't know who he is, go sub up Discovery Bay Comics. Why should you do this? The reason why is because he does like a TV guide for the comic book community. If you want to discover your new favorite channel, it might be this one, it might be another one. There's Caroline Chris, there's Comic Tom, there's Reggie Clutch. There's people all over the place. There's the three main black comics that puts out all sorts of stuff. So uh, if you want to know what's going to be on during the day, you have to sub up Discovery Bay Comics. So, he talks, he's action figures, he's the entire community combined, go sub. He has daughters, and his daughters have sleepovers where he keeps them up till 3 a.m., so they sleep in till 11, and so he can get up and do live streams with his nerd buddies on weekends. Hey, you listened. So anybody that stuck around to the very end, check this out. I got a secret little thing we're going to do. Drop hashtag comic book cousins in the comments of this video for a secret special prize in next week's show. And while you're at it, check out this video that YouTube's recommending or this one. Thanks a lot.